the government is partnering with the Bahamas National Trust and Harvard University Graduate School of Design to map out a sustainable future for the Exumas to avoid mistakes of the past. It's a multi-year project focusing on environmental management, design and planning for extensive environmental research in that island. A forum was held today at the College of the Bahamas with stakeholders from across the country who understand what is important for their communities. As we started facing some of the issues in Exuma Keys Land and Sea Park, some of the development, you know, people would have heard about, including islands like Bell Island. And as we started looking at uh, determining what should take place on an island like that, as an owner wanted to build a home and dredge a channel for his boat, the question was, you know, what are the standards? What are the policies? And we realized quickly that we had to make really high standards and we had to do the best we can in an imperfect situation. We don't want that to happen anymore because we need to think about these Exumas, the Exuma Keys land in Sea Park, uh, the Exuma Keys, mainland Exuma, and the other islands. You know, we have to think about what are the conditions we want to see there 100 years from now. The only way we can envision that is if we come up with really forward-thinking plans. You know, Harvard has come down and, you know, a number of persons have called and said, oh, you all bring it in Harvard, they're going to develop some fancy pants plan that won't be implemented, uh, that won't work for the Bahamas. But that's, that's the furthest from the truth as we could be. What Harvard has come in is to lend its expertise, lend its resources to facilitate the process. Now, Mr. Carey says at the end of this process, they would want to come up with a good land use model that can also be replicated for other family islands. This is not a process that's only looking at the environment that, that we're particularly interested in at the Bahamas National Trust, but we're also looking at um, heritage, culture, um, all aspects of sustainability because you know, you, you have to think about people if you think about planning for their future. You can't just think about the built, the built or the physical environment, the natural environment. You have to think about people are, that are going to exist in these environments. And so government has to buy into it because, you know, we, we, we're not going to develop a report or a paper and take it to government and say, okay, good, go and implement. Absolutely not. This is something government will be a part of developing. And, you know, once the process is complete, then, you know, DPM will take his colleagues at cabinet a process uh, that he has uh, had his, his staff and him personally been involved in, you know. 